We heard from Bill Belichick on Friday, who's ready to go put those pads on for the New England Patriots for the first time on Monday. I'm Sierra Goodwill here with Evan Lazar. And Evan, you asked Belichick specifically about Kyle Duggar and what he's seen from him so far in training camp. And it kind of launched Belichick in this entire explanation about how difficult this preseason is and this season is four rookies said they're in turbulent waters, deep waters, and it's about to get a lot rougher. What does that mean? Well, I think that what we're seeing with the rookies, Sierra, is that there was no spring camp. There was no rookie mini camp. There was no actual mini camp. There's a v- abbreviated training camp. So basically the lack of actual reps on a football field is so limited for these guys and then you also have to consider that a lot of them are competing more for backup roles right now and not necessarily starting roles so at the on the practice field you have guys that you need to get reps that are going to be playing in games in a couple of weeks and maybe you know your seventh round offensive lineman is not one of those guys so just the fact that they have to get up to speed mentally physically all of those things, it's a lot to ask from a rookie who is coming, obviously, from a completely different system, a completely different level of football. It's hard enough for the veterans that have come in here and kind of have a short time frame. Imagine it being a rookie first year player that's trying to adjust his whole life to football, not just the you know fact of what's going on on the field, right. but also what's going on off the field You know, in terms of being a professional football player. A lot of that is very, very taxing for guys, and you see that all the time. So I think it's just a bunch of different things that factors here that when you put the condensed time crunch in it and as well, now we're in a real kind of situation like what Belichick was saying, that they're just trying to stay afloat at this point, and they just are trying to hope that they don't drown. So Belichick definitely alluding to the fact that the rookies might not get as much playing time if they had a full regular preseason. But which of these rookies, I know we were expecting a lot out of the tight ends, out of Kyle Duggar, out of Josh Uche, out of that group, who do you think could actually prevail and see some snaps on offense or defense this season? Well, I think Josh Uche is, is going to be my answer. Now, I think the tight ends, I, I've been pumping the tight ends all mm-hmm. season, so I'll give a different answer this time. I think Ossie Ossie's got a good chance, too, as well, coming from that Chip Kelly scheme. But I think with especially with Uche. He comes from Don Brown's scheme in Michigan. Chase Winovich talked about it last year a lot. A lot of similarities. They do a lot of the same kind of line games, line stunts, pick plays, blitzes, all that kind of scheme pressure that you see the Patriots run in the front seven. Don Brown runs a lot of those same types of schemes at Michigan. So it's a very similar system to what the Patriots are going to ask. And on top of that, they just don't have a ton of depth at linebacker, especially off-ball linebacker. So at some point in time, Uche, Jennings, those guys are going to have to play i think that uche's versatility his ability to play multiple spots both on and off the line of scrimmage is definitely going to help him earn a role quicker i think than jennings who's just an end of the line guy so that's a long way of kind of saying that a similar system in michigan go up to the call you know the professional ranks where a lot of guys like winovich and people in the past have had success making a year one transition and then hopefully you have that versatility to unlock that'll allow him to play multiple spots and take on multiple roles to fill what is, quite frankly, a lot of open spots in that linebacking core. Well, the Patriots strap on the pad starting Monday. The official start of training camp will have plenty of coverage for you on our website at cnlinstv.com. And as always, subscribe to our YouTube channel over at Patriots Press Pass.